We are going to my favorite guest to Chicago, where right now the city council is considering, get this, a ban on pet chickens. Now, believe it or not, more and more health nuts are keeping them for their organic eggs. That is leading to more and more noise and health complaints because the chickens just run around and scream. So Mimi Roth, of course, loves all this. Mimi is the president of the National Action Against Obesity. Crazy. This is weird. <laughs> I have to say I don't own my own chickens, but... What do you think is in this? I would guess a question mark. Well, I think that's what people are concerned about. Nobody knows what's in their food anymore. Yeah. And what people are doing is they're taking personal responsibility. They're getting their own hens, couple in the backyard, and having them lay their own eggs. We're not a third world country. <laughs> you got these chickens running around. And you know, the next door neighbor's saying, Charlie, just cool it. I want to go to sleep. Yeah, well, the roosters are a problem, and no matter what your pet is, I have to agree, the nuisance factor has to be kept to a minimum. But these are people who are concerned about synthetic hormones in the food. But you can buy this stuff at a store. Not everybody wants to pay the price of organic. So they're raising their chickens at home, and you'd be for that? I, I'm not opposed to it. I think if people want to take personal responsibility, this is Fox News, let, let, right? We're let, all about that. Let me, actually, then we should I'm let about, them do it. No, I'm not about no personal responsibility. <laughs> but I, I, let me ask you this. Do you find it a little weird that in order to push organic, I mean, now we're, we're, we're foisting on people the idea any way you can eat clean, neat, good, um, even if it ticks the heck out of your neighbors, do it. Well, I think that we do need to pressure people to take care of themselves. Once you're an adult, go for it. Abuse your body any way you want to, but have a bank account to pay the consequences of it. Don't make me pay it in higher health insurance premiums. But we Maybe don't you have can't the tell right. Me, you were one of the smartest women I know. <laughs> that if you were next door to some guy who had a you know a third world swat of chickens running around the front yard, and you're just saying, oh hey, the chickens look great today, you'd be for it. <laughs> Uh, I'm not opposed to it. Now, the rooster... Uh, that the didn't rooster, me, did you? <laughs> the rooster could be a problem. It could be. But, you know, I don't think we're pitching it the way... Have you seen the video of these chickens running around the yard? Look, I, They look crazy. They look, they look <laughs> like they do anything to calm down. Like the, like the owner is saying, here, watch CNN. But, you know what's a problem? Not only is it what's in these things and the meat itself but it's how chickens are being raised for consumption it's pretty cruel they're in these coops they, they're in cages i'm not, not going to debate they, about the okay, way the animals are raised cruel. i know life isn't fun for them and all that but th here they are running around the neighborhood right <laughs> not and, the neighborhood but you do have options in our country that if you want to pay for organic eating healthy yep. there are ways stores and means to do it but opening up green acres in your neighborhood is not one of them, nor should it be. Well, I agree you can even now go to Walmart and buy organic food, which I think is a great move Have you Walmart. ever been in a Walmart? I have really? been in a Walmart. I, I've, I've, have you I've, ever seen the I've big old Susie Q's in there? They, <laughs> well, I passed that They stuff. are giant. They are giant. They're the size of you. Well, I have conflicting views of Walmart, but I do think it's great that, the, that they're in the organic business, and I think it's making better right, foods but more that's accessible an option. to but others. Mimi, that's my point. But we that's don't have to limit the you. options for those who want but to raise I, their I'm own. I'm not debating it. I, okay. you, you can eat whatever you want. Right. Um, I'm just saying just cool it on foisting this stuff on me if I'm your neighbor, and now you've got you know, a farm going next to me, and I just thought I moved into a community that was going to be quiet. Well, as long as people are careful of noise ordinances and any health concerns, yes, if the bird the flu... Chickens is, are not quiet. Chickens <laughs> are not are quiet. Not, hens are I not worked quiet. the summer on a farm. Let me tell you something. You know, they're not quiet. <laughs> this is so disappointing. Fact, by the end of the summer, I had eaten them all. <laughs> <laughs> so they were, you said they were screaming. They were screaming because they were screaming away them. from me. Uh, but, but you don't have a problem with this. You think this is the way of the world and all that stuff. I think we should encourage everyone to take a more informed and active role in the food that they're putting in their bodies. If this is what people want to do, I think it's a great move. Okay. As long as it doesn't wake you, you up here, with the rooster. I love, love, love when you're on. <laughs> How are you handling the holidays? Well, okay, do you know the hanky-panky diet? I'm not a big fan of any diet, but this is my own diet that I can really get behind. This is a family show, but explain. <laughs> we know that the part of your brain, the hypothalamus, the hypothalamus right. it controls not only your drive for hunger, thirst, and sleep, but also sex. So if you think you might be a little hungry, may I suggest a tall glass of water, a nice romp between the sheets, and a good night's sleep. Really? That'll get you through the holidays. Ooh, bakery? And may save your marriage, Do not yours bakery personally. Bakery products but... good in any use? You, you can don't do cheat it any on way anything, you want. During the holiday, you're not cheating on anything. I don't, 
I you actually, don't cheat, I take, do you? Le, I don't consider it cheating. You I run actually, like 50 miles a day. <laughs> I don't, but I do take care of myself. You do. So you when do. the holidays come, if I want a little indulgence, I allow myself. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, I, I, I admire you, Mimi. You're crazy views notwithstanding. But, but I'm not buying chickens. I have to say, I'm not buying myself chickens. Believe me, you're next door to these chickens running around. <laughs> Believe me, it's not fun. But Mimi, great seeing you. Thank you. If I don't see you before Christmas, have a great one. All right. Well